What happens when every employee sits up and says, do I really want to be here? We have seen through history that as we come through crises, financial crises being a good example, we see a phenomenon that we often call the resume tsunami. Uh, we also sometimes call it, as we started to call it now, the great resignation wave. It's a very interesting phenomenon. People are leaving their jobs before they have new jobs, right? Why are they doing that, right? They're doing that in part because they have confidence they can find another job. They're doing that in part because for whatever reason, they haven't been able to find in their current organization the opportunities and the challenges and the pathways to those opportunities and challenges in their own organization, right? On the other side, almost every company that I talk to and we talk to is telling us, you know, we can't find enough people with the right skills and the right attitudes to do the work. We are at a moment of, sometimes I call 2021 and 2022, the year of musical chairs. What happens when every employee sits up and says, do I really want to be here? Do I really want to do this job at this time for this company? What opportunities do I have? And what talent marketplaces uniquely do for a company is they give you a fighting chance to offer the best story and the best opportunities that you can offer in your company. We are all being barraged by opportunities from social media platforms and from external job platforms. We all know what the opportunities are outside our organization, right? At the moment of the great tsunami, of the great resignation wave, as the, at the moment that we're hearing our employees at every age talk about the, the fear of missing out, we hear our employees talking about you only live once, how do we give ourselves a fighting chance to offer all the opportunities that we have in our organization to our employees, to compete in what is, I don't think only a unique moment. I don't think this is just about 2021 and 2022. I think this is about the 2020s.